Hi, this is Ushu, and welcome to Death Road to Canada. And yeah, we're just gonna fight a load of zombies. Why not? Oh shit, straight to it. Okay. So, yeah, a little while ago, I kind of played a uh, Ollie in the Blind Forest, and I struggled because I didn't have the appropriate controller. I had like a PS4 controller. There we go. And uh, yeah, it's a struggle if your controller isn't specifically made for the game you're playing. Sometimes the controls are a little bit skewed, so yeah, I've now got an Xbox controller. Okay. Don't see Tess, who is a real ding. The zombies are broken into my home. This is probably your fault. It certainly isn't mine. When the group found this zombie bunker, Hiss calls dibs on this big bedroom before anyone else. Leave her for now, Tess. Call it. Help fight the zombies. Yeah. Come with. Lay on the charm. And get Tess to fight the zombies swarming in. She sweats visibly. I'm busy. I'm busy doing stuff. You go do it. Well, it was worth a try. This might have worked on someone that was less of a jerk. Okay. So yeah, now... I actually bought an Xbox One pad, I don't own an Xbox One. But because I'm playing on PC, it seemed like a good idea to get one. And so this is the game I'm going to test it out on. We need to find some zombies though. Choose your pals wisely. Who are you? We meet Delhi. I think we'll have to leave this safe house. At least we got to rest for a while. We should try it. heading to Canada. Would you like me to travel with you? More people means more hands to loot and fight with. It also means more people to get in the way, eat up the food and argue. Come with. We accepted it to the team. Onward to Canada. Okay. Sweet. Is that a zombie? Okay. We've killed our first zombie. Don't get up. Don't get up. Shit. There we go. <laughs> okay. What have I got? Oh, whatever I had I broke. Give me... There we go, a knife or an axe. There we go. So this game, I don't really know a whole lot about it. I think it's just an excuse to explore, meet some people, kill some zombies. Oh yeah, this is good. This is all good. Okay, so we're just going to play and have a little bit of fun. That's a lot of zombies. That was quite strong. Guys, help me out. There we go, get to it. Oh yeah, now we're talking. Uh oh, that's not good. My health. My health ain't good. Smack him. Look at the top there. There is a shitload of zombies. Watch out for huge swarms. Running off and beats fighting. Okay, I'll kill these guys. Nice chill out music. Dude. Dude. Alright, sweet. There is a lot up there. I think we're going to leave them to it. <laughs> What's in here? Start for team swap. Okay, you can swap leaders, so I don't have to be this character. Guys, help me out. That's it. Get some hits in for me. Cool. I need... Is there like a health pickup or something? There's a ladder. I'll take that. Ladder leads to outside. Good luck out there. Okay, you found a ladder. This will end the story for Darren, but your story is about to begin. You will make your way to Canada, looting all the supplies you can on the way. You'll need to build up your skills and your team to survive. That that was just a tutorial. Oh shit, okay. Uh new game, custom characters. What should we name Jade Perk Surgeon? What does that mean? Athlete, mechanic, fighter. This person has always been a real fighter. I'll start with a hatchet. Extra strength and shooting. That sounds good to me. I'll take that. Treat. Uh warrior. Good start with zombie thracking skills with a nondescript personality. Boring personality. <laughs> okay, we'll do that then. And ch change what face they've got. And the hair. It's all random. Oh, a hat. Cowboy hat, yes. Okay. I guess we'll go shades. Gas mask. <laughs> what do we want? Uh, shades, that'll do. Or random. Just go with the random. That dude, why not? Let's do it. Okay, good to go. Yeah. Leader, Addison. I don't know what I'm doing. Death Road, normal mode. Okay. 
Anderson hears rumours that Canada is a safe place, free of the threat of zombies. With nothing to gain from waiting around Florida, she decides to brave the death road and travel north. When exhausted, you start to sweat. Stop swinging for a while and you'll do much less damage. Okay. Hit the road. Get, we need to get some food. To start the journey, the group decides to grab some supplies from the nearby location. In order to survive the death road, you need to hold as many supplies as you can. You'll also need to find ways to train and grow your team. So we go to the, the mart, mart, house on the road, or the quiet hotel. If we need suppliers, I would say the mart. The group spots an abandoned yawl mart off in the distance. It looks like it's been looted, but maybe there's some untouched loot inside. Your zombie forecast is swarm size mild, aggression sluggish, and current time late morning. Okay, we're bargain hunting. What have I got? A flashlight. Okay, I'll take that with me. And let's just go. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, okay, we're in. Let's boogie. <laughs> Do I? I don't have a single thing. So we just gotta go and collect some stuff. Maybe find a weapon or two. Don't get up. There we go. Let's just ignore these guys. Keep going. What is that? Can I take that? Yeah, what is it? A shopping trolley. <laughs> okay, we can go inside. Alright, we're in. Shopping cart. Give me that. There we go. Oh, they're coming inside as well. Is that a wrench? Give me can I take that? There we go. Now I've got a weapon. We need suppliers. That's good. That's good. What else? What's that? Boxing? What do I want boxing for? No. What's this? Was that some shotgun ammo? There's a gun. Give me the gun. Give me that. Ah, oh, sweet. Boom. Now, now we are making real headway. Give me that. That was a burger. Excuse me. I'll grab all of this shit. Yeah. I guess we don't. Oh shit! There's a lot, of, lots of zombies. Too many zombies. Let's go in here. No. <laughs> so we just need to grab as many things as we can and get out. I'll grab that burger. Excuse me. Grab that. And this. Is that everything? Yeah, I think that's good. Let's get out of here. Oh, was there something on the left there? Was that a door? What's through here? Got a femur. Oh, we're in the toilets. <laughs> I killed that guy with a bone. That's it. Don't get up. Toilet. What is that? Open the toilet. Alright. Let's... Oh, shit. Let's, out of ammo. Alright, time to go. I think I raided that place quite well. I killed a lot of zombies as well. Let's take the car. I think we're good. Uh, honk. Start the car. Let's go. Give her. That's it. Gone. We found some burgers, some gas, and... Yeah, 35 zombies destroyed. Cool. The group sets up camp for the night. After being sure there's no danger here, they discover edible berry bushes all around the campsite. The berries wouldn't be a big amount of food for the work, and the sleep is night, but every bit could help. Uh, do we want, um, do we want berries? We got some burgers. We'll go to sleep. The group really doesn't want to pick berries for eight hours. The group eats a decent meal, and we lose four lots of food. So what have we got? We got 11 food. Even in the post-apocalypse, I hate Mondays. Okay. A group runs into a very out-of-the-place vending machine. It looks like someone made it from chunks of scrap iron. Its lights are still on. Everything in the machine costs $20. And the group has about that much wrinkled in frayed bills. Leave it alone. Shotgun fun pack. Bag of chips. New hat. We are low on food. Let's... Yeah. Who should feed the mostly rotted dollar bills into the machine? Warning, this will be a very annoying process. Um, I don't know, Allison, you're the leader, you do it. It takes forever to feed on the dollar bills. The vending machine keeps spitting them out. Allison's morale decreases. A bag of chips drops out, not the usual vending machine size. It's enormous family size. Got that food though. Sweet. Okay, it takes a real strong and fit person to use a sledgehammer well, thanks to the input. 
The group spies the city from the distance. There's more undead than usual, but it's early in the day, so this should be groggy. At least at first. Your zombie forecast is mild sluggish. Aggression is sluggish. Okay, when driving into the city, the group spots something. Medical clinic. Infested stronghold. Infested stronghold. <laughs> Can I... Can we take... Equip? Yeah, equip that. Yep. The shotgun is empty. We don't need a femur. That's shit. Okay. Morale, sad. Attitude, bad. Mm-hmm. Treat, frantic whiner. Ah, <laughs> oh, okay. Let's, uh, I guess we'll go. That's it. We're in. Here, we're in. We're in. Let's boogie. Okay, let's go into this house. Anything good? Into this door here. Anything we can take. That was some food. I'll take that. Let's... Excuse me. Let's go out. There's nothing here. Go back. There was another room on the side. Flashlight. Femur. At least it's a weapon. That's it. Oh wow. Got a zombo point. What does that mean? There's nothing in here. Wow. There's a lot of zombies. I need to collect some food or something. No, no one in there. I'll grab that. That's that food though. Lots of dead people. Trash can. Junk. <laughs> no good. In here? There's just a, a zombie on the toilet. Okay. If we were like cannibals, we could probably eat the zombie. Open the box. More food. Oh, wait, they're coming in. Uh-oh. Let's go somewhere else. That zombie just went into that building. What about Fred's fault? That sounds good. Excuse me, fellas. Yeah. Oh, shit. We'll just run through. Grab that. What is that? It's a, it's a bag. <laughs> okay. Oh, there's all kinds of stuff. Grenade. I'll take that. I threw it. <laughs> Shotgun, flashlight. I need. I keep throwing grenades. Oh fuck! That wasn't good. That was some ammo though. Hmm. Imagine punching a person to death and then he explode because of how hard you hit him. Excuse me, coming through. What is that? A mop. I'll take that. Nope. Basically, I need. Lots of fuel and lots of food. Weapons, I'm not too worried about. Haven't been in here yet. Let's try this one. Oh shit, there's all kinds of sh No, no, no. That's not good. That's all good stuff. I'll take all of this. This weapon is crap. Drop it. Shotgun, I've got two blasts. I'll open that. Yeah, more shotgun. Nope, go back. No. No. What's in here? Nothing. Open this up. More oh, food. Yes. Can we get through that? Doesn't look like it. Get out of my way. Grab that food. Nope. This one? No. Is that another shotgun? Hang on. Get rid of the mop. I'll take the shotgun. I've got two shotguns. How many do I need? <laughs> right, let's, oh, let's go up. No, nope, no. Nope. We need some fuel. That would be ideal. There's not a lot going on. Okay. This, this building looks good. We'll go in here. We can't get through that, can we? Shit. Uh-oh. Come on, guy. Let's go. Should we just take the car? I wanted some fuel or some petrol. Alright, let's go. Start the car. Go. Alright, we're out. We've got lots of food. One medical, some bullets, 40 zombies destroyed. Oh, we got lots of fuel. Needham needs, tries to help, but lacks enough medical supplies. Uh oh. That's not good. The group finds a cabin in the woods with no zombies in sight. It has a wood stove in it, but no wood. The group eats a decent meal. Uh, 
Shall we just go to sleep? Then maybe that will make him happier. We lost a lot of food. He tries to help. We still haven't got... We need more medical supplies. Addison's not doing very well. The group is poking through an abandoned house and finds a Ouija board. <laughs> it's a common game used to communicate with ghosts. These things are rumoured to be incredibly cursed with bad luck, so beware. Still, it may be worth asking it a question. If it's not so today, will we make it to Canada? Who will betray the team? Where's the loot? Uh, where's the loot? The Ouija board spells out the location of a hidden stash of loot in the house. More food. The group now feels incredibly unlucky. Beware of the curse of Ouija. Luck massively decreased. Somewhere in the distance, a goblin laughs. <laughs> oh, we got that food though. Sure, there won't be as much mosquitoes in Canada, but what about grizzly bears? Outside of Canada, most of society and civilization has been destroyed. You can still find people engaging in trade with, with preserved food being the new currency. You have 25 food left. The group runs into a trading camp. Uh, yeah. Let's visit. Okay. Okay, there's all these people here. Okay, let's talk to this dude. This suspicious person is wearing a mask and holding a fancy silent sniper rifle. My weapons are so quiet you will attract much less zombies per shot. Uh, silence pistol for 3 food, sniper rifle for 25. What else is to shop? What have you got? A sturdy military flashlight. Uh, healing spray. We need, I don't know, I think we need some medical supplies really. This guy. It's an old but fit man in matching grey sweatpants and sweatshirt. He screams something about building mass and bulk and intense strength routine. He flows towards some heavy objects lying around. You got, okay, what we got? Training, group training. Use your charm. Eden accidentally comes off as creepy. The group is asked to leave. That didn't work. <laughs> uh, okay, and the food person. The group sees a woman standing near a stockpile of crates. The crates seem to contain a large amount of food and drink. I've got food. I'm looking for some great weapons. Uh, we got two shotguns, haven't we? Shotgun for one food. Uh, that doesn't seem like a good deal. What else have we got? We got two shotguns. Yeah, let's spare it. That seems like a bad deal, actually. A uh, silence pistol for three food. Yeah, we'll do that. Got a silence pistol. I have a few more for sale. If you want silent firearms for a whole group. I don't know. This guy won't talk to us anymore, will he? No, he won't talk to us. Okay, let's leave here. We need medical supplies. That seems to be our, our next one. Off we go. Go, that's it. Go, go, go. No zombies. Good. There are still people alive and well. It couldn't hurt to team up with more survivors. There aren't any around. They didn't want to come with. The group finds a new person, Dion. He's alone and wants to join the team. Dion claims to be great at fixing cars and machinery. He promises that if something breaks he can fix it. Please join us. The group accepts Dion to the team. Onward to Canada. Alright, there's now three of us. Allison is healed a bit by Don. That's it. Dion's medical revealed he's not very well. The car gets stuck in a ditch near a crappy dirt road. The group is close to getting the car out when a roaming horde draws near. Now they must distract the zombies from getting too close. Siege alert, there's no escape. Hold size large. Oh my god, try to survive. Okay, let's... I don't know. Let's beat some guys up with flashlights. I got... I do have a pistol. <laughs> I got no bullets. Okay, let's just see what happens. Allison isn't great on health. But let's just see how we get on. Just survive. How long do we have got to survive for? Is there a timer somewhere? Oh wow, there's not a lot of room, is there? Let's try a different weapon. Boom. Kaboom. Oh yeah, I'm going to use up all my shotgun shells. That's such a bad idea. Flashlight. Okay. How do we know the time? How do we know how long we got to last for? Well, at least there's three of us now. Uh oh, my flashlight broke. And they're sweating out because they're hitting too many people. No, uh -oh. shotgun time. Shotgun. The siege is over. You can now try to escape. Alright, sweet. Let's do that. Leaving. Do you want to walk back to the road? Let's hit the road. 
Okay, oh, we got some gas, so that's alright. And we still have some shotgun ammo. 18 zombies destroyed. Oh, that was rough. Needham's happy, the other two, not so much. I wish I was playing more video games and less hiding from zombies. Dion tries to help, but lacks enough medical supplies. The group feels inspired after managing to survive the situation. They feel like they're getting the hang of this. Choose a reward. Morale and random skill gain. Morale and one health healed. Medical. What should we go for? Morale. Yeah, I think so. We all need to be happy. Time heals all wounds, especially zombie bites. Okay, that's made everyone a little bit happier. Zombo point earned. Use... Zombo point to unlock traits, perks, and more on the title screen. Okay. Everyone's happier now. Furniture is the natural enemy of the zombie. <laughs> the group camps out in a big field. The group eats a decent meal. They find a row of cans sitting on a wooden fence. Uh, what are we going to do? Let's shoot the cans. The group gets some shooting practice by blasting the cans. All their shooting increases. A man in red, Long John's, runs onto the field with a pitchfork. My cans, my precious antique cans, look what you've done to him. Okay, uh, the morale. Some people, yeah, they didn't find it funny. Sure, laugh at the dude. <laughs> okay. Bandits catch the group by surprise. In a really terrible spot for them to fight in. They demand that all the food and half the supplies are handed over. Money or your life. What? Run. Offer a compromise. Tell them to call it. Come on, Dion, what you got? Dion tells the bandits to call it. The bandits are not amused by it at all. They open fire. Dion is hurt. Oh, everyone is hurt. Dion is killed! <laughs> uh, on the plus side, most of the bullets hit Dion. Oh, man. That's not good. <laughs> oh, we're not doing very well. What next? While driving on the death road, the group decides to make a stop for suppliers. We have to. Uh, swarmed rest stop. No, grocery store. The group finds a grocery store. Zombies wander inside, as if guarding the remaining food. Your zombie forecast is mild, sluggish, late morning. Go shopping. Uh, let's take the wrench. Sweet. So yeah, we lost Dion. Whoops. Alright, let's boogie. Oh yeah, the wrench is strong. But it's slow. Let's just go inside. I want to grab everything that there is. Oh, I needed that. Food. Yes. The wrench is really slow. Oh, and I'm sweating. It's really heavy to use. Change, change your weapon. Change your weapon. Alright, I'll just grab everything. Ignore the zombies. Flashlight. And a shotgun. Oh, there's a door. Let's go through this door. Oh, what was that on the shelf? Grab that. Let's go in. It's the toilets. And there's nothing in here. What's in that toilet? Oh. Oh, that was some fuel. Okay. Leave now. Excuse me, guys. Bam. Bam. Oh, shit. We are... Oh, fuck. Running out of ammo. Hit that guy. Please be some... Oh, shit. There's all kinds of stuff in here. Spatulas. That's it. Grab that. Grab everything. And the Zombo point. Oh yeah. Is there anything in these boxes? Uh oh. I'm getting hit. That's not good. No, 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 no. Am I dead? Everyone else is dead. Needham is all alone. Oh, okay. Got a frying pan. Uh. Okay. <laughs> this isn't good. This is not good at all. Let's leave. I think I think I need to leave now. I've got a lot of food. They all coming in now actually. Ah shit. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. No, no, no. Wrench is crap. Get rid of that. Go through the door. Go through. Is there anything in here? It's just a massive toilet leaving. No, 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 no. What can I grab on the way? Any money? Any money in here? I'm, I'm not sure. Grab that. I think it's time to leave for sure. Pistol whipping my way out. Ow. Ow. We'll get to the car. It's just... There's just one person left. Alright, let's go. 
Go. Go, go, go. That didn't end very well. We've got lots of food. <laughs> Six zombies destroyed.